So guys, let's go ahead and do some basic plotting with the matplotlib library. To start plotting, I first need to import the pyplot API from the library so that we can use it in our plotting. So to import that, I can say import matplotlib.pyplot as plt and then I can use that to create a plot object. So I can say plt dot plot and then inside the plot object I'm going to pass in the views variable that I have declared here. Now the views variable basically contains the number of views that a YouTube channel got in the last seven days. So after creating the plot object we are going to declare the show object. So basically plt dot show. So this is going to use the data that we passed in the plot object and use it for creating our data visualization. Let's go ahead and run this. So here you can see that uh, matplotlib has created an okayish graph using the data that we passed. Now remember we did not pass any x axis data. So therefore the x axis has been numbered from 0 to 6 here. Right? There are 7 data points in our y axis and matplotlib has used 0 to 6 indices to label in the x axis. Now remember when you pass a single parameter the data is assumed to be for the y axis only. Also never forget to add plt.show to the end of your plt.object otherwise you are just creating an object you are not going to see any kind of plot. Now let's go ahead and put in some data for the x axis as well. For the x axis I can say I can declare a variable called days and I'm going to assign it the day number from Monday to Sunday, right? We have seven data points and we are going to assign the day number from Monday to Sunday for these seven data points. So I can either say one to seven like this, one, two, three, four, five, or I can do a, uh, take a shortcut and do it in a more elegant way by saying days equal to range one to eight. This basically tells Python that return me a list starting with one, ending with eight, but don't include 8 so not to include include the last element also there is no step mentioned here step is basically what you would mention after the end element so if a uh, step is 2 then python is going to return us a list containing 1 3 5 7 like that if no step is mentioned python is going to use the default step of 1 so basically it is going to return me a list from 1 to 7 now to pass in the days variable, uh, basically the data for the x-axis into our plot object, we have to use something like this. So plt dot plot. First we pass in the data for the x-axis and then we pass in the data for the y-axis. Using the above logic, let's go ahead and first pass in the days variable here and then we pass in the views variable. And let's run this code. So now you can see the y-axis values are the same but the index has changed for the x-axis. Now Python is using 1 to 7 indices to show that uh, to plot the data for the y-axis. So this is basically how a basic plotting works in matplotlib. Now even if the graph looks okay it doesn't say anything right. There is no labeling there is no legend we don't exactly like if you show this graph to someone strange like a stranger he is not going to understand what this graph shows. So in the next tutorial we will talk about labels and legends and how to make our uh, graphs more visual. Thank you guys and see you in the next tutorial.